Hello, my name is Thomas and I've lately returned from Haworth where I enjoyed a Spitfire flyover, I enjoyed a speech from a Winston Churchill look-alike and I've enjoyed some great 1940s music. That's because Haworth has every year a 1940s weekend that's very, very popular. It's a very small village, Haworth, probably most famous for being home to the Bronte sisters, those giants of 19th century literature who gave us such works as Wuthering Heights. Their father was the vicar at the church there. And you can still go today and get a little bit closer to them and their stories. But once a year, Haworth is taken over by this special event. Of course, it is a small village. The best way to get there for this huge event is to take the steam train. The Keefley and Worth Valley Railway is one of the best historic railways in the UK. It's been used for hundreds of films and TV shows, most notably the Railway Children, several versions of it, including the most iconic one, the Jenny Augeter. I took the, uh, the Keefley and Worth Valley Railway to Haworth stopping off at Oakworth, which is one of the key locations in the film. And it was wonderful to have a little wander around. If you're not familiar with this story, I've got a link to a podcast episode on the Railway Children, which is in the description below. Carrying on through Oakworth, you get to Haworth, and there, as I say, I got to see a Winston Churchill look-alike <laughs> giving a great speech, got to see the Spitfires, and that was wonderful. It's a very distinctive sound that you hear in all the movies, but to see it in real life was a joy. And there were just so many people enjoying the food, enjoying the drink, enjoying the spirit of the occasion. As I say, this is a great get-together. People normally do dress up specially for it. I'm in civilian wear, of course, but you can find plenty of those in uniform of the 1940s. I would recommend absolutely anyone to go. So maybe I'll see you there next year.